welcome to all on Twitter. In today's session 5 of all quick review plus 2 physics. Applicable for CBSC board and state board, no doubt it is also important for J main needs UT and other entrance examination. In this case, I am going to discuss three questions. Question 1, question 2, question 3. Question 1 on conductance, different cases, then charging and discharging of battery and switch of voltage load and laws of photoelectric effect, laws of photoelectric effect application. These questions will be discussed one by one, right? Now, question is, the following data was recorded for the value of object distance and the corresponding value of image distance of the experiment study of real image formation by conductance of power 5D diopter. One of these observations is incorrect. Identify the observation gives reasons for choice. There are six cases are given to you. Object distance is given to you, the size of the image is given to you. We know power equal to 1 by F in meter. Therefore, F comes out to be 100 by 5, that is 20 centimeter. Now, before finding the answer, we should know the basic concept. Position of object. Position of object. Image formation. Image formation. First, position at infinity. Second, infinity and 2F. Third, at 2F. Fourth, 2F and F. Fifth, at F. Sixth, F and optical sign. There are six cases. Means if lens is here, like this, this is the optical center, this is F, this is 2F, this is F, this is 2F. Right? Now, if it is at infinity, focus. At infinity and 2F, it will become F and 2F. 2F at 2F. 2F and F, then between 2F and F, then beyond 2F. Beyond 2F. At F at infinity and other side. And these are the cases. Now, in this case, F is 20 centimeters. So this is between, this is all the object position are between F and 2F. In this cases, all the three cases are between infinity and 2F. 2F is broad enough, right? So in this case, image formation will be between F and 2F. Yani between 20 and 40 centimeter. This is correct, this is correct, this is correct. In this case, beyond 2F. Beyond 2F, beyond 40, this is 97, this is correct, this is correct, this should be beyond 40 centimeter. Therefore, this observation is incorrect. This observation is incorrect. I will discuss this question in detail, right? Or now, next question. In the two electric circuits shown in the figure, determine the reading of the ideal meter and ideal volt meter. Now, this is the figure A. Direction of current is given this way. We know KVL. Kirchhoff's water is low. Summation IR equal to summation E. <coughs> Sign convention for E. Living point of the terminal. Is a sign. Sign to EMF. Right? Now in this case, living point is 9, 9 plus living point is 6 equal to summation IR. 
1 plus 1 into i. So 2i equal to 15, i equal to 7.5 ampere. This is the figure A. Now, in figure A, voltage is being, current is being drawn from the cells. Current is being drawn from the cells. We have to find the voltmeter. Means it is a case of discharging. Case of discharging. In that case, V equal to E minus IR. V equal to E minus IR. E is 6 volt minus I 7.5 into 1. That is 1.5 volt minus. In figure 2, in figure 2, Again, applying the KVL, in this case, direction of current is given like this. Leaving point is 9, leaving point is 6. 9 minus 6 equal to 2i. That is 3. i comes out to 1.5 ampere. Now, current is being fed into this. So, this is a case of charging. In case of charging, v equal to e plus i r e is 6 volt plus i 1.5 into 1 that is 7.5 volt right this is for this one that is what that answer charging and discharging identify charging when current is fed into the circuit battery discharging when current is being drawn from the cell so what we do today we use the concept of charging and discharging a meter Find the current summation I R equal to summation V. Sign convention for that with the sign of V is leaving point of the turn bar is assigned the sign. If your direction is wrong, then sign of current will come out to be opposite. Make it rectification according to that. That's all about KVL and charging the charging. Next question. The graphs here are the phenomenon of photoelectric effect. These two graphs are given. Identify which of the two characteristics, either intensity or frequency. Of the energy being constant in each case. And name the quantity corresponding to the that one. In this case, no. You know photoelectric photoelectric equation. Einstein's photoelectric. Kinetic energy maximum or h mu equal to h mu naught plus e v naught and v naught comes out to be h mu minus h mu naught divided by e divided by e means kinetic energy maximum or stopping potential stopping potential depends only on frequency and not on not on intensity not on intensity second if intensity is increased intensity is increased Number of photons incident. No photon incident on that photoelectric surface and the surface increases and emitted photoelectrons also increases. Miss photoelectric current. These are the two concepts in this case. Now, in this case. These are the difference. These are the difference. So, what will be the constant in this case? And what will be constant in this case? We have to find out these two things. Now, in this case, stopping potentials are different. In this case, intensity will be constant. Intensity will be constant. In this case, frequency will be constant. Frequency will be constant because stop and potential is same. Now in this case, 
this is the saturation current. Whatever we make the stopping potential of intensity now, saturation current. This is stopping potential. Stopping potential. This is all about that I have discussed in each case. Now, this is about, about the photoelectric effect. This is about Pitcher's voltage low. This is about image formation convex lenses. All these questions are very, very important for the CBSC board examinations and state board. Now, I would like to request if you are new to my YouTube channel, City Swift Learn, please like and subscribe to my channel. Press bell icon to receive updates on conceptual videos on through illustrations. Thank you. Thank you.